still haven't cleaned that up. Okay, so I literally just walked through the door and I was like, I'm gonna film this video because I am so excited about what just happened in my life. Me and my friend decided to go to the thrift store and it happened to be 50% off day at Valley Village. Everything was $2 and nothing hurt. I don't think I've done a haul video since... It was a long time, I think it was like November, I, I don't know. Whatever, let's just get back to the root of the matter. Um, Valley Village was very good to me. I spent $45 for 15 things. What? That's ridiculous. And it was great because I, w I basically went in and came out three hours later with so many wonderful new things and I still had time to swear to go to the dentist to get a root canal. So I'm going to start with accessory things that I got. I got this little claspy bracelet. Oh, it still has the tag. Everything has the tag on it. Whatever. It's a belt for your wrist. See? Look at that. Like that. Then I got this little um, nameplate necklace, and also it has someone else's name on it. And if you know me personally, or maybe I've mentioned this before, but I have a weird thing for items with other people's name on it. Like I have a necklace that says Sandy, my keychain, my keychain, my keychain says Christine. So many things. Then this says Joanna. Music make you lose control. Music make you lose control. I got this necklace, which is like a little choker, and it has little guys on it. Can you see it? It's nice. This one, I really like this one. It's a face chain. And I got this little necklace. Go to town and marry Bastion! Bastion! Bastion? Bastion? Is it Bastion? Name that reference. This is a necklace that goes here and I think it looks really nice and simple. It's a Bastion! So the first item I got is this kind of pencil um, gingham print skirt and it immediately reminded me of Cher from Clueless, so immediate buy. The next item, this long black floral dress. Long, it's long and it's floral and it would look nice for spring. I see it with like some cool boots, a denim jacket and like a bowler's hat and I'd be posing like this. I'm just super glad that I had the chance to finally go thrifting. I haven't been thrifting in such a long time. I just felt like I was just, just went back to my roots. The next item is a little crop jacket that it kind of reminds me of like a cowboy. It has like this funky like cow print kind of and it fits like a dream. Like I usually buy a lot of oversized and baggy things like a lot of my jackets aren't very fitted but this fits me so well. Save a horse. Ride the subway. Conserve energy. The next item is a little bit more like I've never Anyway, here it is. It's this deep plunge, plunging neckline chiffon blouse. What I like about it is like a really, I don't have a nice shirt. <laughs> I just don't own nice things. I'm just excited to new, wear new clothes for spring. I feel really confident with my body lately. I've been drinking lots of water, exercising, eating lots of vegetables, especially root vegetables. I also got this shirt that I'm wearing and it says coach on it, and the reason you can read it is because in real life it says coach backwards. Wow, who is this girl? She's so quirky and unique. Wow, what a quirky shirt. What? It's backwards? It's... In keeping with condition... In keeping with tradition of shirts that say things on them that don't actually mean things to me... Uh... What? That didn't make sense because what I was going to say is this actually means something to me. It's a t-shirt that says boring on it. So, um, what? Who, where did she get this shirt? Oh, where did she, did she make it? It's quirky and unique. Oh, she's boring. No, she's not. Well, I kind of. Then I got a couple just basic tank tops, which are spaghetti straps. I haven't worn spaghetti straps since the third grade. This was interesting for me. This olive green tank top, and it's kind of, it's like a really soft, um, like, this is just like a v-neck tank top that I'm just gonna wear on my body person. Easter's coming, and I'm gonna be a walking mini egg. So cute, look at this little shirt, it's like a new shirt, and you put all your little chocolates in it on Easter morning. Spring colors, speaking of spring colors. The last clothing item, still have something else, is this amazing midi, like, 
dusty rose skirt. So it comes down to like a little bit past my knees and it's pleated and it's the most amazing color and I adore you, I adore you. I feel like Grace Kelly or I feel like a girl in a skirt. You made me feel like I was wearing a skirt and really that's all I could ask from you. So you did it. Okay, so the last thing I got is a pair of shoes and they are the most comfortable shoes. I could have ran a lot in them and just kept running because maybe someone was like chasing me. Someone, so someone was chasing me and I was like, I gotta run. I gotta run and I kept running and I went for a while because they were so comfortable and went like maybe they gained on me but I was like, no bitch, which boots? I call them witch boots because they remind me of something um, the Sanderson sisters would wear. And they have just a little bit of heel, but they lace up all in the front. So crazy and lacy. Lacy. So crazy. So goddamn comfortable. Like I said, I, I would just keep running and. Alright, that's all she wrote, and that's all she bought. But let me know if you want me to do. Um, a lookbook or anything featuring a few of these items, if not all of them, because I'm pretty much in love with them all, and that sounded like I just said I'm pretty much in love with the mall. And I'm not. The mall here in my town is awful. Do you see these? Do you see that? Do you see that? I don't know what to do about it. I'm... Nothing's fine, I'm torn. But whether I should go to the hairdresser But I don't want to spend any money And if I do it at home I'll mess it up And then my hair will look funny <laughs> Maybe something go wrong and it'll turn my hair And I'll bad and I'll be a ginger I'll be a different kind of root Hope you enjoyed watching this video Just a little quick impromptu one that I didn't plan But you know, some of the best things aren't planned in life I'm here today, so. Is it Bastion? Let me search this up. Yep, it's Bastion. Bastion!